Love is a powerful emotion that can bring immense joy and happiness to our lives. It can make us feel alive and vulnerable. But what happens when love becomes one-sided? Unrequited love is when one has strong feelings for someone who does not feel the same way. It can be a painful and difficult experience, leaving you feeling rejected, heartbroken, and alone. Sometimes, the relationships start as equal and then change when one of the parties loses interest in the relationship. Other times, the relationship is intermittent, you only see each other every few years, and you both feel a strong connection, and know that there can never be anything more to it than that. I think the movie He's Just Not That Into You did an excellent job of explaining this phenomenon cutely with the rule and exception approach. This article will delve into the different aspects of unrequited love, including its causes, signs, and ways to cope. We will also explore how to find healing and move on from the pain of unrequited love. So, if you're struggling with unrequited love or know someone who is, this article is for you. Let's dive in and learn more about this complex and emotional topic. Unrequited love is a type of love that is not reciprocated. It occurs when one person has strong feelings for another person, but the other person does not feel the same way. This can happen in any relationship, whether it is romantic, platonic, or familial. It can be a difficult and painful experience, leaving the person in love feeling rejected and alone. Unrequited love can result from many factors, such as timing, distance, or simply not being the right fit for each other. It can also be a result of one person being emotionally unavailable or not ready for a relationship. Whatever the reason, it is important to understand that unrequited love is not your fault. You cannot force someone to love you, no matter how much you may want it. Unrequited love can have a significant impact on our mental health and well-being. The constant feeling of rejection and heartbreak can lead to depression, anxiety, and low self-esteem. It can also affect our ability to form healthy relationships in the future. According to research, unrequited love can activate the same brain areas as physical pain. This is because rejection and social exclusion trigger the same neural pathways as physical pain. This can result in feelings of sadness, anger, and anxiety. It can be challenging to tell if your love is one-sided, especially if you are in denial or have strong feelings for the other person. However, some signs can indicate that your love is not being reciprocated. One of the most obvious signs is when the other person does not show the same interest or affection towards you. They may not initiate contact or respond to your messages or calls. They may also avoid spending time with you or make excuses when you try to make plans. Another sign is when the other person only sees you as a friend and does not express romantic interest. They may talk to you about their love interests or dating life and not consider you a potential partner. Coping with unrequited love can be a difficult and painful process. It is essential to allow yourself time to grieve and process your emotions. Here are some ways to cope with unrequited love. Allow yourself to feel your emotions, it is important to acknowledge and express your emotions, whether it is through journaling, talking to a friend, or seeking professional help. Practice self-care, take care of yourself by engaging in activities that bring you joy and relaxation. This can include exercise, meditation, or spending time with loved ones. Set boundaries, if being around the other person causes you pain, you may need to set boundaries or take a break from the relationship. Focus on your goals and passions, redirect your energy towards your personal goals and passions. This can help you regain a sense of purpose and control in your life. Finding healing and moving on from unrequited love can be long and complex, but it is possible. Here are some ways to find healing and move on. Practice forgiveness, forgive yourself and the other person for any hurt or pain caused. This can help release any negative emotions and allow you to move forward. Let go of expectations, release any expectations or fantasies about the relationship, and accept the reality of the situation. In the practice of mindfulness, this is called radical acceptance. Focus on the present moment, practice mindfulness and focus on the present moment rather than dwelling on the past or worrying about the future. Cultivate self-love, practice self-love by treating yourself with kindness and compassion. This can help boost your self-esteem and confidence. Self-care practices can be a helpful tool in finding healing and moving on from unrequited love. Here are some self-care practices you can try. Exercise, regular exercise can help boost your mood and reduce stress. 
Meditation Meditation can help calm your mind and reduce anxiety. Journaling Writing down your thoughts and emotions can help you process your feelings and gain clarity. Spending time in nature Spending time in nature can help reduce stress and improve your mood. Engaging in creative activities Creative activities like painting, drawing, or writing can help you express your emotions. If you are struggling to cope with unrequited love, seek professional help. A therapist or counselor can provide you with guidance and support in navigating your emotions and finding healing. Unrequited love can be a painful experience, but it can also be a valuable learning opportunity. It can teach us about ourselves, our needs, and our boundaries. It can also help us grow and become more resilient. While unrequited love is not entirely preventable, there are some steps you can take to avoid one-sided love in the future. These include Pay attention to red flags, be mindful of signs the other person may not be interested or emotionally available. Communicate your feelings, be honest and direct and ask the other person how they feel. Don't settle, don't settle for a relationship that is not fulfilling or healthy for you. Focus on building a solid foundation, prioritize building a strong emotional connection and getting to know the other person on a deeper level. Unrequited love is a complex and emotional topic that affects many people. It can be a painful and challenging experience, but knowing you are not alone is important. Understanding unrequited love is the first step towards finding healing and moving on. By practicing self-care, seeking professional help, and learning from the experience, you can find healing and move forward toward a fulfilling and healthy relationship. Remember, you deserve love and happiness, and it is possible to see it.